Assalamu alaikum and hi everyone. So today we would like to present our product Lantan Dialect Voice Interaction Recognition Towards Indoor Human Helper Robot to MIIX2024. So firstly, I would like to introduce our project member. So this project will is led by Nur Shahmina Ahmad Azhar, a Master of Electronic Engineering in UTEM and followed by me, Nick Muhammad Zarifi, our collaborator from Telkom University, Bandung, Indonesia, Dr. Mahmoud Dwi Celestio, followed by Dr. Zamri, Dr. Normi Zabri, DS Najmiah Radiah Muhammad, Dr. Siti Fatimah Sulaiman and finally DS Azhari. Let me introduce our post product. So basically in our society we already recognize that the Malay language have a several variety of dialect which consists and existing in Peninsula Malaysia. So whereby one of those is uh, what we call it Kelantan Patani Malay dialect whereby it is existed on to the north of the peninsula uh, included the Kelantan states, some parts the northern Terengganu and the northeast of uh, Pera and Patani Sala and Songkla. So that would be in total 3.5 million people who are conversing in the that particular dialect. So towards that basically to compare with the standard Malaysia language with the Kelantanese Malay language so basically we take one example ikan for instance fish in Malay so whereby when we put it in um, Kelantanese dialect we will have ike so this is the one that we try to portray the idea of conversion sound to image profile so this one is ikan in spectrogram images and this one is ike so we can take a look at the idea of uh, this region so the frequency domain of the information over here is kind of uh, different so makes sense in uh, embarking the uh, research in neural network or in deep learning towards AI okay right so the problem that we face is here uh, basically this problem came by when people are neglecting the linguistic diversity present in Malaysia so because we have several uh, dialect so this neglection will brought some of the speaker are facing challenges utilizing the voice technology okay there's still a lack of recognition and support from the original dialect speaking of the objective so we are targeting to analyze the otic and and first edict characteristic of Kelantan dialect in the form of uh, design and voice recognition. So later on, we try to propose a comprehensive data sets of Kelantan dialect uh, speech images and followed by recognizing Kelantan Malay speech pattern uh, whereby as I mentioned earlier, we will convert sound to image. And finally, we try to propose the prototype for voice instruction recognition towards the human helper robots. So speaking about authenticity and novelty, in terms of the intellectual property that we have right now is we initiated the uh, new Malay Kelantan dialect for uh, instruction particular uh, wording text so we collected left right front and back in Malay Kelantanese Kane Kigi Depe Blake towards the putting the data sets exist okay. the second one is here we propose the first systematic application to embark more advanced researchers in the future for this regional Kelantan dialect studies so by far we already published and presented one of our work in worst proceeding paper in ICDEC 2022 and this paper paper has been awarded as best paper award during the uh, international conference. So speaking about this set, so on the left top is the pan images sound and the uh, right hand side is blaka and the left is kanan and the right is kiri this one and followed by the additional uh, group that we add to the class is hingar so so that there will be other classes in terms of AI analysis. So this is the proposed set of desktop and mobile or the kdvonary UI user interface. So this is the one that when we run the apps through the website so this is the desktop kind of things so this is the mobile ui for this particular apps okay so here we buy this is the running sound wave that we have in our surrounding environment back to the uh, the apps and immediate after we say something so this output scale will be instantly giving you the results so likewise belakang depan kanan and kiri so whereby this obviously the apps is clean friendly cloud computing real, real time and percentage display also will be provided as 80% and something so this is the uh, the whole structure that we are expecting to do in our next product so this product we focus on KD Voinre so this is the one that we invented for today so in future we are proposing one more thing so maybe the next competition utilizing the robots and we have instructed the apps to pull to use the robots to pick up one of this particular indoor object so currently we are in uh, TRL number 3 based on the MOSTI so classification model conducted in lab using uh, five classes okay this is the one that we using right now uh, VGG16 kind of reliable network in real application right now so the one that we did uh, propose also we did the quantitative analysis uh, experimental so whereby we can say now we are 95% accurately um, recognize the voice or terms that has been produced by the speaker all right so why we initiated this product and did the study in topic basically by far if we take a look at this chart so we are at the top uh, 20 of uh, the language 
language that been used in all over the globe so Indonesian in Malay is, is considered in one languages so speaking about the what we can and what we can't do so currently we can do recognition through the voice for Malay Kelantanese dialect 95% accurate so and then we could claim it without just using voice to move a robot and we can utilize them everywhere and yeah obviously by using the mobile and it is economy and easy to use so speaking of the economical basically I would like to uh, discuss about the selling price so currently to build up this particular product so we subscribe the Google Collabs Pro for a month in order to train them so like 9.9 uh, .9 USD so equal to ringgit Malaysia 40 ring 40 and we are expecting to sell this particular apps about 200 ringgit including the uh, research materials and so on so these are the benefit and impact to society so basically we wanted to enhance the accessibility despite of the 3.5 million Kelantanese Malay dialect user to join with a standard Malay language user powering the RR 4.0 and the recent developing AI so we would like to assess the uh, essential services to up there so meaning the east coast region of peninsula Malaysia so whereby we also wanted to promote the technology literacy for the people like 3.8 million people at that region so next I will be demonstrating this particular product so the product will be asking about to allow to use the mic so then I will be pronouncing belakang uh, this one so the, the system detecting belakang and then the pipe and yes and then kiri based on the three tests that we did just now showing that the reliability of the output from the system is acceptable so I think that's all for our presentation for this particular products uh, See you and thank you so much. Assalamualaikum.